Common Table Tennis Injuries and How to Prevent Part 4, Table Tennis Injury Treatment Table Tennis Injury Treatment Lesions in tendons injury result from repetitive joint overload is often difficult for physicians because of the complex interplay between soft tissue anatomy. For the treatment, you need to ask for advice of physicians and doctors. I would say get surgery is the last option because our body has its own mechanisms to heal itself. Take time so your body can recover. However, when it takes a too long time, more than six months, you need help from conservative treatment. Operational management is considered after trying a conservative treatment but should be approached with caution as favorable results may not be realistic and may not return to the previous level of play. Here is some possible solution that may help you. Stop playing. If you have a wrist injury, it is imperative to rest your wrist. If the pain is really important, a removable thermoformed wrist splint can be helpful which is prescribed by a doctor. Resume gradually. To resume training, you must wait no longer to feel pain for at least a week. If you have elbow injury, you can play mainly by rotating your body, using mainly the waist rotation. Don't use too much elbow in your stroke, but generate the power from your body, called rotation axis. Practice the feeling, play close to the table avoid hitting hard. You can also use a lighter racket which will help. It is during this recovery that it may be wise to buy an elbow bracelet in pharmacies. Worn about a centimeter below the elbow, it can protect the elbow and reduces the shock. Knee Strap Knee strap is a good way to prevent knee injury in table tennis. Top players like Wang Hao, Zhang Jai often wear a knee strap. Far Infra Heat When you have the tendon and shoulder pain problem which can last very long to heal, you can help the body to heal faster by increasing the blood flow. This will bring in the building blocks to restore the damage. Heat does this, and direct heat pressed against the injury site to a reasonable temp for 30-minute intervals is something to consider. So using far-infrared heat can heal your pain faster. This method is effective for shoulder FIH heating and back FIH heating. Far-infrared heat is effective at getting the heat to penetrate deep into the tissue to stimulate increased blood flow. Magnets also do this. There are many FDA-approved back braces that have a series of magnets in the brace to perform the same function as far infrared heat. Ice the elbow. You are hurt in the elbow after the training session? As soon as possible, freeze your elbow for a minimum of 20 minutes. The challenge, do not let the pain settle down. Ice cubes in a plastic bag do the trick first. Then, to renew the operation several times a day, you can use a bag of frozen peas or buy in the pharmacy pack cool. Ease the pain. Different drugs can be less painful of paracetamol if the pain is important or local anti-inflammatory to be applied by massage. The gel diclofenac, the topical gel is often advised. Hydration and nutrition. Important, do not forget to hydrate yourself. A lack of hydration can indeed promote tendonitis, says Dr. Jacqueline Jan. Also, avoid alcohol and high-protein diets for 48 hours. Cod liver oil and fish oil can be beneficial for muscles, blood vessels, and joints. These oils are essential for senior and veteran table tennis players. Using a good omega fish oil will reduce the risk of ankle and a knee injury, providing enough joint liquid lubricating synovial fluid. And if that does not happen? If the pain persists despite stopping table tennis, local care, and hydration beyond four weeks, or the pain is annoying in everyday life or prevents you from sleeping, it is best to consult a doctor who can refer you to a physiotherapist. This is the end of my research about table tennis injury. It takes me a lot of time to do the research. So I hope you share this article for the table tennis players who need this. See you in the next video. My name is M. Rat Tick, a table tennis coach in France.
If you like my videos, please support me. Read more about table tennis on my blog, pingsunday.com. Get free ebook and coaching advices. See you in the next video.